Hi! This is here with a patch note reading for 324.1. And they have nerfed the all flame exile thing. It's all over. Pack it up, boys. We had a good run. I'm gonna read the patch notes and we'll see if there's anything that can be done. All right, cool. All right, so this is gonna be the 324 patch notes. We'll start off with the tier 17 map changes. Many modifiers that can roll on tier 16s can now roll on tier 17 maps. I guess that dilutes the pool, making less of the crazy modifiers. But you'll also have some really crazy that normally you can roll on maps like min max and stuff like that. Um, they're more rewarding, the ones that can only roll on tier 17s, enhance pack size, and enhance item rarity, more currency found, more maps found, or more scarabs found. And from what I'm being told, they are pretty crazy. Tier 17 map bosses have a significantly higher chance to drop Elder Guardians, Shaper Guardians, Conqueror maps, and Synth maps. Tier 17 maps will always roll with one exclusive prefix and suffix. Tier 17 maps that contain rare and unique monsters remove percentage of life, now only removes life from their players or their minions. Obviously, there was a big bug with Einar. The rare maps and unique monsters spawn tormented spirits on reaching low life. It can no longer roll. Right. So that's, again, they just want to try to get rid of, like, some uniques. Because people are maybe abusing it. Who knows? Necropolis changes. The Lantern of Aramor now sorts by Devoted and Haunted modifiers, then by tier. Um, implicit modifiers on base types are now uh, displayed. Updated the description of the untainted all flame monster packs to clarify they drop no items. Harbinger can now longer have unresolved anguish. Gemling monsters have a 50% chance to contain unique monsters. Uh, previously, 100%. That's fine. I mean, they should also reduce the damage on that one. The Gemling one is crazy. The graveyard crafting that caused items to craft to be corrupted, providing 50%, can no longer reroll the crafted item. Oh. Does that mean it can't become rare anymore? So this is always to like guarantee a corrupted implicit. That's huge. That's huge. Um, the offline member of Anarchy now causes a monster pack to be composed of a single rogue exile instead of multiple. One singular. So <clears throat> the beyond strat wasn't changed. The anarchy strat was changed. Um, there will still be things that'll work. And I was already working on something that works. But um, pretty big nerf. All flames are going to shoot down in price. Uh, and mostly be used for conversion. How many was it before? Uh, up to 15 or 20. General improvements and changes. Detonate Mines is triggered when you move passive skill and now grants a separate instance of the skill that is triggered, so you can also manually detonate your mines. Nice. The Syndicate Mastermind now drops Veiled Orbs in area of 68 above, previously 78 and above. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, because I did a lot of low ones and didn't get any. Um, so it's 33% higher between 73 and 77 than it is in the low, low ones, and 83s have 50% higher. Cool. Sounds like a good change. Significantly reduce the volume of War Cries, Blood Rage, Detonate Mines in... Uh, they did not reduce Arcane Cloak, by the way, I noticed, as a Archmage Enjoyer. But the others are good. Items dropped the modifiers that cause imprisoned monsters to have a chance to drop a rare item with Essence Mother are again now identified. Yay! That was a big issue. They would drop unidentified so we could hover over them to see what they were. So they've now made it worse. Honestly, I don't like how they're like so insistent on making identification cancerous when identification is a very outdated mechanic in an ARPG. In my opinion, identification only makes sense in CRPGs like Baldur's Gate or very, very slow games where scrolls of identification is an actual resource. They have to be careful what item you can identify. And it also is only important when you can actually wear unidentified items to try to discern what it is. And then you have some sort of downside like a cursed item like you can have in CRPGs, right? Where you put it on try to figure out what it was, you can't take it off because it's cursed and now you have some sort of downside and you need to work towards getting rid of that. That makes sense for that type of game, it does not make sense for Path of Exile in my opinion. Remove the single frame delay before an item tilted to shot when hovering an item. Ah. Updated, I didn't even notice that but that's good. Updated the description for Deadly Prey. Updated the New World Order achievement, red or purple tier when a horde scarab applied. At least three different deafening essences rather than three deafening. Oh, okay. Trade website changes, all flames, and tier 17 maps 
All right, enter the bulk exchange and a maximum. Loads of bug fixes. Let's see if there's any important ones. Um, fix an issue when a fifth impales and plate they're removed. Oh, okay, just a tooltip bug. Righteous Fire and Plague Bear would apply their degen if you had 100%. Oh, to you? That's so fun. That's so fun. That's so fun how that happens. Like the damage becomes inside us. Um, spawning less shrines than expected. Rogues could be obstructed in heist. Wait. Wait. Oh, this is huge. Heist enjoyers are celebrating. Okay, it seems like mostly minor things in the bug fixes. Either way, um, obviously, I think most people saw this nerf coming with the lantern stuff, especially watching people get 10 mirrors in one day. 10 raw mirrors, by the way, not 10 mirrors worth of value. Um, it was um pretty obvious. I'm sure we will adapt and find other fun things um, to do. But uh, it does suck for the people that weren't able to use the strat. Although you could do the strat in tier 6 maps. So uh, hopefully everybody was able to play around with it for a little bit. Anyway, uh, pff, it is what it is. We'll find something new to abuse. I'll try to let you know ASAP what that is. Thanks for watching. Sub if you like the video. Let me know what you think of the changes. Oh my god, everything is dead. Try to die. Less than rogue excels do.